First Alert Weather with Caitlin Napoleone. 515. Happy Wednesday morning, everyone. There's going to be a fog concern. Not only is it reducing visibility in places like Lindenville, Springfield, Keene, Bennington, Rutland, where visibility is all in all those places down to a third of a mile. It's also going to be freezing fog, which means it's going to make some very slippery road conditions in some places. So please be watching out for that. Leave a little bit earlier so you can drive extra slow. Not only again because of the visibility, because it will be slick in some areas. This is why pretty chilly out there. Even the ground has really continued to cool off, contributing to that slick factor 28 right now in St. Jay and Newport 29 in Burlington 18 in Saranac Lake and even along the Connecticut River Valley our temperatures are at or are at or below freezing so watch out for that potential other than that storm tracker is pretty quiet things are really settling down after all the action that we got yesterday a nice mostly clear sky for now and across the entire region really not much going on all the action is to the south of us and all those very severe storms I'm sure you've heard about in the news uh, is off in Texas and the Great Plains and it's a messy situation there but things have really calmed down for us and we're going to enjoy the sunshine so it's going to be quiet around these parts temperatures in the mid and upper 30s by noontime will be topping off in the mid and upper 40s later on this afternoon and evening and again the sunshine is going to be the theme for the entire day probably going to even though it's chilly out probably going to continue to melt anything left of that snow that we had from yesterday future cast quiet all the way through the rest of today we'll find just a couple clouds rolling in and out we're dry to start off your Thursday morning and into Thursday afternoon. Maybe a few more clouds that'll kind of creep in, but other than that, it's still dry and pretty quiet, and we should avoid any rain chances all the way through the end of the work week. That is also, with the help of the sunshine, going to help us warm up. It's going to be a slow warm up, and there will still be that chill in the air for the next couple of days. But tomorrow, into the low 50s, upper 50s for Friday and Saturday with that sunshine. We'll find again some clouds in and out for the next couple of days, but it will be very, very dry once again. Our next chance for rain will be Monday and into Tuesday.